forgot that one. All right. Oh, 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 oh not, not okay, it. there we go. Oh, he got a letter out. Sewing the seeds of learning. That's the focus for a dedicated group of hatters each and every day. Medicine Hat MP LeVar Payne and his wife Michelin had a chance to join for a day the local child care association to see what it takes to be an early child educator. Well, I, I think it's going to take me back to uh, when I had young, young children and uh, worked with them. So I think that that's going to be uh, an interesting aspect. If I think back about what I did uh, in raising my children to see what happens now, probably a huge difference in, in the way things are being done. The experience helped highlight the importance of early childhood education and showcase facilities and approaches working with these little ones. Or who is that? So I knew that. I could tell by the ears. The Paynes visited Carly McKay's Day Home, Montessori Children's House, and the Minnesonette College Child Development Center. Association Coordinator Jennifer Usher says her team would like to see a national child care plan developed in Canada. But we do know that our system across Canada is really disjointed. It's not consistent across from province to province. We would really like to see some kind of a strategy nationally. While reacquainting himself with the wonders of dirt, coloring, and jelly beads, Lavar said the experience showed him the importance of choice and federal support. I believe that uh, the individual parents need to decide what's best for their children. And to continue on to reduce taxes so that families can make the best decision for their, for their families and their children. Medicine Hat currently has more than 30 licensed day homes and child care facilities. And Jennifer says the workers in these places are doing much more than looking after preschoolers. Uh, they're not babysitters and I think that's the, the thing that we really would like people to understand is that this isn't just to simply uh, supervising your child and providing a safe environment, that's part of it. But it's more than that. It's really about children's learning and growth. For Go Southern Alberta, I'm David G.